Yeah, I don't, I don't think that was the sort of key. I think the whole game, I'm really pleased with the way we handled um, the whole day, to be honest. Uh, obviously, we knew it was a you know, significant game coming here. Tough venue, good opponent. Um, you know, I just thought, you know, obviously the atmosphere here, they get behind their team. So I thought all, with all that, the context of all that, I thought first half we did really well just to make them work hard more than anything else. I thought they, you know, they had to try and contain us and, you know, the threats they had, we, we kind of snuffed out. And then, yeah, I, I, I got a sense sort of towards the back end of the first half that, you know, they were beginning to, to already tire a little bit. And that was kind of the message at half time, just persevere, stay calm, play our football, maintain our intensity was going to be important. And we did, we got off to a flyer and then the quality of our football was, uh, was excellent, um, you know, to, to see out the game. Yeah, I'm not really sure. He doesn't think it's anything too significant. So disappointing for him because it was he was outstanding again uh, up until that point. But you know, great for Radu to come in. Uh, it's his first sort of significant game time in a big game, and I thought he handled it really well. Was that the best uh, yeah, I don't know. You know, it's it's hard one to sort of assess because you know, th you know beginning of the year we we played in some big games and I thought we we, we handled ourselves well. But yeah, considering. You know the context of the game and like where you, you know, the venue and the opponent. Um, I thought it was it was as controlled as we've been in any game all year, and just in the way we handled everything. And uh, yeah, it's, a, it's a it's a positive for us because again, you know, we we know there's still a lot of growth in this team, and that's one of the areas where you know can we control games even against quality opponents. <coughs> Yeah, really important. Um, you know, we we work awfully hard without the ball as a, as a collective. Um, but you know, at times this year we've, we've we've let ourselves down in terms of just conceding, you know, from areas where we shouldn't. But you now the focus has been really good. Uh, look, it, it, you know, obviously Mickey's out today, but it's good when you get a settled sort of back four as well. I mean, that that pay, plays a significant difference in the middle of the year. We were kind of chopping and changing, so it's hard for for us to sort of maintain consistency. But, um, you know, they're, they're obviously a threat. Ollie Watkins had an outstanding year, and even today he was a threat, but I just thought we handled it really, really well. I mean, Vic only had a couple of moments he needed to be involved, and he did that really well. But I thought our two full-backs were outstanding in the way they, they kind of swung across, and, um, yeah, the centre-backs all, all did a great job. Yeah, I guess so. Look, I mean, I, I think I said before the game, this, the, I still think there's a significant part of the season to go. There's still 11 games for us anyway. And, um, you know, there's there's so many challenging games. And, and, you know, every game will have meaning between now and then. Not just for us, for every team, you know. There's a fight up the top, there's a fight down the bottom, there's a fight in the middle somewhere. Um, so we're all fighting for something. So. I don't think, you know, even if we had have lost today, I don't think that would have discounted us from, you know, whatever other people put on as targets for us. But, you know, I think I've been consistent in saying what's important for me is our growth as a team. Um, and I thought we saw that today. It was another, you know, positive step forward for us. Um, Villa have been very successful here this season, playing in a certain way, in a certain system. How much of a compliment is it to your team that they could just live that quite consistently? Yeah, I mean, oh God, no, I mean, that's... You know, I still think, for the most part, the, the basic sort of principles in their game doesn't really change. Um, you know, they're still, you know, very well organised, very well structured. Uh, <clears throat> but, you know, I think, like I said, for us, part of our development as a team is to have a real clear identity that hopefully challenges other teams to, to change their approach against us. I don't think we're there yet. I think, you know, there's not enough evidence that we're that compelling as a team yet for, for teams to adjust. But... Obviously, with these big games, it's really important for us to you know, kind of show that, irrespective of kind of the circumstances, this is how we're going to play. And you know, it's up to the, up to the end of the opposition to try and stop us. I don't think it was a key moment. I thought we were well in control um, at two 0 Obviously, it made the game a little bit easier for us in terms of territory, but I thought we were well. In ascendancy, and I think it's just a byproduct of the pressure we were putting on um, the opposition. And um, I don't think John meant anything malice from it. I think it's probably just frustration more than anything else. But um, you know, I, you know, I felt 
quite a few decisions that were going against us on the day. It seemed like little niggly ones. I mean, I can't believe Pape, you know, was the only one that kind of got um, a yellow card today. But I don't think it, I don't think it changed the game. I think we were, we were well in control by that stage. Could play a part in what? <laughs> yeah, you're keeping us there, aren't you? All right, no worries. Uh, nah, don't. What's important for us is um, I thought we scored four good goals today from key players who need to be scoring for us. I, you know, I, I keep saying that's still the area of the park where I just don't think we've got bang for our buck considering how hard we work in that front third. I think, we st even today, I thought we had more opportunities to score, but I, I was just really pleased in the execution of all our goals and the, the players who got them is important for us. That's that's more important because I think we can be a team that scores a lot of goals, um, but we're not, you know, obviously we're still a work in progress in that area. So to get four goals, especially away from home, and the players who got them more importantly, I thought, and the execution of them, I thought was really, really pleasing. Yeah, I mean, but he missed a hell of a lot of football and he's only sort of just, I mean, we've got a few like that who are just sort of getting, you know, their rhythm going again. But yeah, good for him. It was, it was again, a really good goal for him because it was m as much about his <coughs> endeavour as his quality, you know, just getting into those areas. It's it's kind of things we talk about constantly that, <coughs> you know, like I said, if we're going to get more reward for our <laughs> good play and our hard work, we need more players sort of making, that, having that endeavour to get into those areas to score goals and... Obviously, Matters is one that plays a bit more advanced, so he's one that, you know, we know he's got quality to score from just about anywhere, but really good goal that, you know, he kind of attacked an area where we need him him and others to attack. And it was a great ball by, by Pape too. Like I said, I'm really pleased with our goals. They were stuff we work on and um, great for those individuals today um, that they all contributed to it.